It is Earth Day, a way to celebrate and raise awareness for environmental protection. This morning, 12 News reporter Max Dutton joins us live in downtown Wichita to highlight a local nonprofit who does their part in helping the environment. Good morning, Max. Yeah, Britton, good morning and happy Earth Day to you as well. Now, I wanted to talk about Kansas Pro Recycling. They're located over in South Wichita. I actually got a chance to see the behind the scenes of their plant earlier last week, and they provided me with some pretty cool statistics as well. Now, in the last 15 months, They've recycled over 25 million plastic bottles. They've saved 81 millions of gallons of water and 36 million plastic bags. Some pretty substantial numbers there. Now, on top of the plastic that they recycle, they also accept paper, glass, metal, books, cell phones, rechargeable batteries, and DVDs. Every year, Earth Day has a theme set by EarthDay.org. This year, the theme is Planet versus Plastics. The organization has a goal of a 60% reduction in the production of plastics by 2040. They also say 100 billion plastic beverage containers were sold last year in the United States. That's more than 300 bottles per year for each person in the U.S. Now, of that 100 billion, only nine, only 5% will actually be recycled. 95% of those won't be recycled whatsoever. Members of the team at Kansas Pro Recycling explain to me the importance of recycling. You can save the earth by recycling. If everybody everybody participated in it. I would say it's fun. I mean, recycling, it makes you feel better at the end of the day. We are, you know, the leader in a lot of things in the world. Why not be the leader in recycling? And a couple of events that are on the horizon to look out for on Sunday. Cedric County is hosting their second e-waste event where you can dispose of e-waste properly. Then on Saturday is the annual Arkansas River cleanup. We have all of that information under the links we mentioned section on our 12 News website and on our app. Britain.